All right, we're back and we're going to finish up the last two simple requests for our API. It's going to be delete and it is going to be get single. So we're going to do router.delete and it's going to have a an ID as well because you don't want to just delete them all. That would be bad. You don't want anyone to have that kind of power, right? So we're going to say db to do dot where id is rec dot params dot id dot delete it's not dot delete this gets me every time I forget it it's dot del so dot del dot then function well I mean we don't really have any data to send back right I mean what do we send back well we'll just send back a request dot json and we'll just send back success is true. I mean, that's really all they care about, right? It's like, hey, I successfully deleted this. Um, nothing too difficult about that one. Uh, and then we're going to do a get a single ID. It's going to be very simple. Dot request dot get. It's going to have an ID on it because you only want to get one of them. Request result. We're going to do db of to do dot where ID request.params.id dot select dot then function data res dot send data so let's try our get request first our server's still running if yours isn't make sure to give it a give it a go so we'll do a get of api of one we'll, we'll run that bad boy hey look at that we got it let's do two Hey, finished post is true. What about three? Do we have a third one? I don't actually know. Ah, we don't. But that's what will happen. It'll send us back nothing. Let's do another send. So here's all of them. Here's three. We don't have, and here's two. Now, you noticed something earlier. If you Let's see if you notice the difference between whenever we first ran get all and when we now ran get all. Give it a second. They're out of order. Since we updated ID 2, that's the one it's sending first. That's kind of how Connects works, is it's not going to order it by the ID unless you tell it to. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to do an order by for this. So it's very simple to do. Select star from to do dot order by ID. That's not bad. So now when we run it, it's going to order by ID. Descending, obviously. If you want it to be ascending, you can do that. That's not hard. It's pretty simple, actually. So that's the end of this video. We're going to move on to the uh, front end next. It's going to be in React. It's going to be very simple. The UI is going to be simple. I'm not going to do anything super special, but we're going to have the ability to use all of these. So that way that you can kind of get a feel for how they work on the front end and how that connects to the API. So I'll see you guys next time.